Hello, I'm Kaylee Guzman, a transplant nurse coordinator with UC Health. In this video, we'll walk you through what you need to know about caring for stents and drains post-transplant. Some patients may leave the hospital with a Jackson Pratt drain, also known as a JP drain. These drains have a small, soft bulb at the end to collect extra draining fluid. This bulb can be emptied and squeezed to provide suction. It is important to keep a log of the amount of output from the drains to help us decide when it's the right time to remove them. After you have measured the drainage, you can empty it into a toilet. Some patients may leave the hospital with a biliary stent. This can be external or outside of the body or internal, inside the body. External stents may be attached to a bulb or capped. You can expect to have these stents in place for four to six weeks after your transplant. External stents will be removed in clinic. Internal stents are intended to pass naturally through your intestinal tract. Before you are discharged from the hospital, your nurse will work with you to make sure you feel comfortable managing any drains you may have. If you have concerns with your drains, you should call the post-liver transplant coordinator team. As always, we're here to answer any questions you might have. To learn more, visit uchealth.org transplant.